<laughs> yeah. So here we go. We are talking about love. Yes. We're talking about Valentine's Day. Yeah. And this past week, we did tell you about how the Botanical Gardens, Gardens yes. After Dark, amazing love events week. all this week for yeah. Love Week. Yeah. Today, if you're looking for something to do with your lovey, make sure you head over there because they have a Valentine's Day event tonight. Yes. But tomorrow night, they also have another event. It's called the Love is Love event. Yeah, that is amazing. And we have great people with us here today yep. from Niagara Pride Center. We have Ronald oh. and Sherry. Good morning. Good, Good morning. morning. Happy, Happy, Valentine's Happy, Valentine's yes. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's Day. So we are talking about the Niagara Pride Center and all the great work that you do. So mm -hmm. let's start out with the mission. Tell everyone who you are. So in a nutshell, Niagara Pride, we're a 501c3 nonprofit. We've been around for a couple of years as a nonprofit, but around for over 10 years as a social group. Mm -hmm. Our mission is to educate and to do charitable works uh, involving the LGBTQ community throughout Western New York. Mm -hmm. And I love that this is exactly why you are participating with the Botanical mm -hmm. Gardens. Yes. You're also participating with um, the Pride Center of Western New York as a group. And so it's nice to be able to be in these these events yes. where you can reach out to the community. Tell us about what's happening yeah. tomorrow night. So tomorrow night, uh, ourselves and the Pride Center, as well as a couple of performers, we're gonna be there to hand out information and to really celebrate that concept of love is love, mm -hmm. that it transcends gender identity, orientation, that really it's about the concept of loving individuals for who they are, no matter what they are. Mm -hmm. Love it. So, so it's really about educating, yes. educating people, right? And yes. you have several events that we're going to talk to. Can, if, if you could say anything to people out there, educate us a little bit, because at these events you're educating people. What are some of the main points you want people to know? So primarily we want individuals to realize that the LGBTQ community still faces discrimination. We still face adversity. And so it's really important to, for us to be able to go out there and to show people that um, there are centers, that there are people who are supportive, that are creating safe spaces, that diversity and inclusion is a wonderful thing, that it shouldn't be feared. And then there's ways for individuals, businesses, agencies that want to embrace diversity, we can yeah. teach them how to do that as well. You mentioned being able to provide a space for programs. Mm -hmm. And yes. that I think a lot of folks might not realize mm -hmm. that a lot of your outreach events are also fundraisers yeah. to help fund those programs. Can you speak to that, Sherry? Oh, fundraising. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, we're doing a 5K, Yep, which will be in May. Mm -hmm. um, I'm excited about it. I'm a runner. Um, it's going to be at NCCC. Uh -huh. And and there's Runs also a, a shopping yes. event, correct? Yes, yes. Shopping there is a Pride. shopping event, yes. And I think that people, if you, running's not your thing, correct? <laughs> correct. Uh, the reason I bring up the shopping event is shopping, shopping is, is mine. definitely my thing. Shopping is mine. Um, yeah. So there's something for everybody coming up yes. in yes. 2023. Yes. What other events do people need to know about? Because I'm sure there are plenty of folks out there who mm -hmm. want to support you. They want to be able to help, but they want to know what's coming up. So I'm just going to circle back just really quickly, sure. just to say uh, kind of why it's important when they're, when folks are attending our events, especially with donations, because you brought up fundraising. Mm -hmm. And it is a key component, unfortunately, that we have to do. Mm -hmm. We don't receive any state, local, or federal funding. We don't receive any grants. All of the programs that if you go to our website and look at all the things we're doing, those are completely funded 100% by donations. So it's wow. super important when folks come, if you're enjoying it, if you want our work to continue, to please donate to us. But in terms of some of the events we have coming up, we're doing a Western New York uh, LGBTQ health and wellness fair. Mm -hmm. uh, that's gonna be on March 25th, it's a Saturday at NCCC. We'll have uh, approximately 50 vendors there to teach people about different services, and community organizations providing services for LGBTQ folks. We've got the uh, Western New York Pride 5K that Sherry talked about. Uh, that's on May 20th, 20th. Uh, at NCCC. Mm -hmm. And then Shopping with Pride, which is our big event. So that is an opportunity for us to showcase LGBTQ and allied owned businesses throughout Western New York. Yeah. We highlight them, we showcase them on our website. Uh, we promote them through all of our social media. So if businesses want to be part of that, 
they can sign up uh, through our website. There's already a dedicated uh, web page for that. And it's a great event for everyone to learn about yeah. diversity. We were just showing your website, actually. If you could yeah. remind folks what your web address is so that they can find it themselves. Super easy. www.niagarapride.org. And you have an events tab there. I can see yes. it. So yes. make sure you bookmark this page. Stay on top of the events because, again, I can't say this enough. I'm grateful for what you do, and yeah. I know that there are resources yeah. there that people need. Yes. So thank you so much for doing what you do. Thank and you. And thank you for Love is Love. Yes. Thank you so much. And Sherry, I'm not a runner, but I, I, I can shop right. <laughs> oh, you I can, can totally shop. Drop. You can walk. You can walk. <laughs> you can walk, stroll it. Walk, and stroll it. Oh, yes. And then go shopping after. Yes. We appreciate all <laughs> of that. You.